Okay, Mary, I think we are live now. If you can just unmute yourself again, and then I'll confirm that people are seeing us. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Oh. Right. Okay, I think we are good to go now. I can see ourselves on live. Let me just confirm. Yeah, that's it. We we are we're good to go. Um, good afternoon, good afternoon, and welcome, welcome to the um, digest news. I am Fatu Baji. Uh, with me today is Mary Sok. Uh, Mary Sok is the 2021 presidential aspirant, the first female who has come out and and shared her intention um, to contest uh, for the 2021 um, presidential election. Uh, apologies again for the delay um, in starting the program. We had a little bit of a technical difficulty using Zoom, but here we are. Um, thank you very much for joining us. Assalamu alaikum badingolun jalam fatu baji ngal bismillajang digest news nyuto nga uluntam bala soto jambi memu madam Marisokti Marisok dung albea lonepo. Ni watul kono diamosi ata Gambia kata chile kita musu follow ti memfi tita nang twenty twenty one election onyeng aka lafta keke president orti so um, nga kumandi jang dorong puru nae kacha bayi a interview jama sutole order platform orto mea longko um, interview ni nga yake angale kamola yake fanang surua kamola nata na badi manding call fana nata ka fuko itul fana bela fela ka long juma ne mare sokte um prani e kacha bitung mari uh, welcome to the digest uh, news thank you very much for um accepting our invitation thank you thank you for having me on your platform the digest news thank you for inviting me Thank you. Um, without wasting any time, Mary, um, we will get into the conversation. Madding on Benin Kachabi Kela Angal a Suro a Madika Kamoding Angalela, so in Tabo Madinin Kala Angalela, at a Fanam Benjabila Angalela, but in Natana Mbembasa and Esoto, Mbembasa and Ebe Marilla Timoto, I be Madin Marco in a car in the main Kachajan car for Madika Kamolo. A Marikita Moti Maya Lonka, Wuta Gambiere, a Kuluta Wolefan and Tobanju, a Natana Tama. Atata Spain, Abota Spain, Atata America. Um, I business all for Nanke business Jamal. I be into property management. I will business also to live for Fana. I entrepreneurship all the Mati. I mark with Jamal Eke in the community. Um, but I go to Dalga Mira at a former Baira Bijane. About four no long to the end. At a butter Jumal Bala. Mary, a lot of yeah. people say Sock. Sock mm -hmm. is a surname that they are not familiar with. Um, it is not like a Baji or a Sise or a Jalo that ordinary Gambians are used to hearing. Can you tell us, Mary, um, where that surname came from? Well, if you um, know Banju, Banju comprises of uh, different kind of people, especially in the days when people were migrating into Banju. So the Sok family also migrated into Banjuru from the Senegal region, which was in, um, how do you call it, uh, from St. Louis. So this is how the Sok came into the Gambia, just like any other ethnic um, groups that came to settle in the Gambia at the time. Mm -hmm. Remember? Um, Okay. It's 
So I can jamano mum ko e wala jamano mum tamita wala sre pe jamano alti. Ka tandi la ko ata pora daan sendi. Ka tandi mo la ko banjun ding wala mahi awu ta banjun le anong palang amung dambe ano. Kung banjun manding kala mo lal be ya kala mo la ko marisok mangke luntan di dambe ya amung dambe ti mo le ti mung pora banjun sa te pono mung ka dapat dambe la capital ba. Tonya, so ache asa phone mo liyan ne, um ala family ni mujumalti, jumale matip mamalti yana ala parents soli sa jako maybe gibir lali sa a connect join sol ni connect nole. Maria o mo ila bang o question mo. I can understand you. Yeah o mo ila ha. You mo ila ba ke? Ha good. Yes, my family um we are diverse. Um hold on one second. I I don't. I'm sorry, I'm being distracted by hands moving, so it's creating a lot of uh, distractions for me. Um, but yeah. we are coming from, my family is so big, you know, when they came into town, we intermarried, you know, so you have, I'm also, I'm coming from the Sok family. Um, in the Sok family, for example, my dad is a Sok, my grandmother is a Fai, and when you talk about the Fai, uh, she later married to the Ogu, and, um, when you talk about Fai, you also talk about the Jais, you also talk about the Tourists, you talk about the um, Lloyds, you know, the family is extensive. Then you go as well to the Proms, the uh, Blaines, you know, it's, it's a whole community, you know, of uh, uh, Christians and also Muslims. And then when you come to my mother's side, you know, my mother's um, father was Nigerian, but my mother's mother came from the Foster and the Carroll family. Now, if you know the histories of the Fosters and the Carols, they, they intermarry. You know, right now, my family, because of the intermarriage and interconnecting in the Banjul area, we have families to Nijame from Badibu. So we have families from uh, the Jola family, like one of some of my cousins, the Jola. You have, I have a sister who's a half Manjago. You have um, families from the Fulas and from the Farahunde because they intermarried so much, you know, and the warlock. To the point, this is one of the reasons I say I'm related to everyone, because my family is so diverse that within ourselves alone, we are multi-ethnic, you know, we are, uh, how do you call it, a multi-ethnic group just in our family. So that, if you look at Banjo in the old days, it was like one big pot. We intermarried and everybody knew the apples in those days we're just marrying, you know, the men were not many, they traveled, so the women were here, and there was a lot of interaction in the community. Mm -hmm. So that is yeah. really what it's all good. Yeah, but I can back it, Mary. Remember, I'm going to say, oh, summarize no more, Mary, I'm going to say, okay, so, Mary, I'm going to say, 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 you know, more than long ago, Omun Gambian, Dingoleti, Obama, you know, a a Nigerian, but Dingolso to Obari. Katan di lako, amamalia friends or tole munsa katan di mo lako, kung amangke bandalan ko di. Andung anara kay Gambeti, more than yung mun salamu ta ko, ka kung maning ka Dingoleti ko, Obama falan na karoro, anara ba Dingolso to jang anim mun kita Nigeria bangko ka. Nana start amamakaro la muni along ko ay friends or tole munun pukuta. Dah mungkin lepas kini alam itu aku all perlu dah mengambil lelai secara boleh jualal mungkin ada ni model aku imam perlu suka ni ikut ada insyo bela kata ni gambia all bela aku mari sok ada model denda amang ke aku amu aku amu mengambil amu gambia noy jeda mula sah kalau muda noy yang badi mengambil ni lama elal. My mother was born here. My mother came from Nigeria. My mother was born here. Yeah. Okay, ako katani mo la aman ke ko ma maybe la mo irlal si akilo dubake ko abama hulu da Gambia jale katani Gambia ang ko la ko abama mo Gambia no. Sa sa fe ka aman ke luntan si Dana ka Gambia di mo la hulu ta banyun la hulu ta Walter. Hulu ta banyun. Mm -hmm. So between an adum getting to know Marisok as a person um to look at your values, what do you believe in? You know some of the some of the things that you cannot compromise as a person. Um, wale mani kaka ngoti alo kama mumineti niyo kama marisok marisok lo kama mumineti. My integrity. 
Um, my integrity means a lot to me. I cannot compromise that because we all live, and when you live, you want all these people to think about some, you know, to have something to think about you. And integrity for me is everything. Of course, along that line, you have your achievements, you know, your adventure, your courage, and everything. But integrity is just everything. Integrity. Integrity more for no member. Integrity in this is going to be interesting, Mary, because even I cannot say integrity in Mandika. <laughs> Maybe if we have um, someone called Aliu Manjang or Sarata, my colleague can tell us what that means or how to yes. say that. Huh. But ngambira, um, ngambira kame for integrity, ngambira waleng, kum like ila, kum tonya dal, kalu tonya ye, ngambira waleng de. Along that line, Kodi? Kum ka, ngalong dal, wala bede ka, tonya tandi, aninka tao sembeng tu yandi, ka tonya ka, ya, kol de la ko, that's the word. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> you must add that in your in your um, um yes. Yes. Yo, what am for ya? Ti bitun tolle nga moy ñola naw nga dung nang leadership skills ñim fango to. Bay di mari be lasirin ka ke ñaton kolti. Nga lo ne already fango abu ñaton kolti because amu CEO in in the enterprise that you are leading on right now. Um I just want to know what are some of the leadership skills um that you possess that makes you confident that you can lead this country. Munem ñaton ka ya Taman Sierolti, many along for Maria Sotro, um, may a Jacodia la Coati say Bampo in Sambano. Yeah, one of my um, main uh, leadership skills is communication. And um, communication is my strength. Um, the problem we're having right now in this country is communication, lack of communication, lack of talking to each other. So one, when, once you have communication, you really can, uh, you know, it's one of the most important skills a leader can have. And the next one, you know, you have honesty, your integrity as a leader, you know, um, this is what will help you to be able to rule, you know, your relation to build, you know, with your people as a politician. Also mm -hmm. developing that uh, skill, you know, like my leadership skill, you know, so that I can be able to connect with everybody. So when you talk about um, these skills, communication is key, your honesty, your integrity, you know, these are very powerful um, skills to have to be able to lead. Without them, you know, it's, 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 a, it's a, how do you call it, it's a platform for failure. And I think mm -hmm. I possess that even in my daily um, life or business, I make sure I communicate effectively and I make sure whatever I do, I try to do them with integrity you know, and try to be as honest as I can be with my dealings with people on a daily basis, much to say on the scale that I'm uh, backing on right now. Abana Kamari, you member? Okay, I come for a experience in the Kake Nyatong Koti Bangkokan. All I need to call Polo Polo Kata ni Mola Po, Ani Mola Moe 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 I think I understand co then men will dial ah mumula problem or the mulata kefula nyama for and the wall and you co. Miaja moly tambin the wall and lan noti moma laila at eight at eight and mindila. So wala no nyu at a wallet and the car for co, you know, wala tina at a same most of a new hamoni bruka low, you know, ka katani gambia and cold bela for co yin ne bato, and katani palanko kanaba business of palancono, what palantara Paul Connolly Muyatina, a la Bizoni Paul Vita Ranyata, Wolong Papo, Animola, New Moyo Carola. By the New Moyo Mantara Dao, the Wolong Communication on Yinti, on the Stanley Dataraji, New Moyo Sonia Alta Mongol Tema, on Minanata Catania, a la Poca Poco, 
mola la non ming ani mola nyom moyo wala na ka xamendi pour kallo you know ka 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 na bango samba nyaabe mhm wala tela xamul okay thank you bari mari ni aji be um president ya ki sa do ko ti maya lon ka kole ya ta bakhir so you would be expected to make some really difficult um decisions um itela assertiveness abe nyadile ani la decisiveness how how assertive are you and do you have the ability to make difficult decisions and if you do can you give us an example where you made those difficult decisions well um you know in life in your everyday life you as an as an entrepreneur as an entrepreneur you do have instances where you have to make decisions and take risks and even though you have a team sometimes the team can make decisions for you but then if you realize that these decisions um you need to take it upon yourself and you feel you go with your gut feeling that these are the right decisions then you have to go with it let's say for example with what we have right now with the covid-19 i mean if i feel that my team is not doing what they're supposed to do as far as reaching out or to the people um as far as possible i mean i'm watching tv i'm following the trend i'm following what's happening and when i as a head of state will take a stand and have to uh, put my foot down and do what i got to do to save the people or save our country by closing the borders on time not having to wait for other countries to close the border so these are um, certain um, how do you call it uh, certain decisions uh, as a head you have to do that because your people might be going uh, according to policies and wasting time on paperwork and all that and sometimes you need to take that necessary step to do what is right and make a proper decision to do what is right at the right time. So yes, these are, you know, things that we uh, thank God we are into the entrepreneur, you know, we're, uh, we work as business people and sometimes we have to make these decisions. So mm -hmm. making those kind of decisions as a head of state for me is more or less the same because I've been in that arena before where I have to make those decisions and thank God there have been decisions that have been um, very good and um, positive for us. Okay, yamu akamu komo le wolo ni tiko bari ani ni kapo ate mu a lani ay mu ay mu ate lo ta nyaade le pro ka sibni soto ka lo gambe no nyaado ka mo ni wolo ka mu ta ni ko ni ni la ka la nyaado ko di for example lo ta nyaada ni mo la mu na ni 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 ka la nyaado ko di so ate le nyaado step ta la ka ta ni gambe ya banko mo la ko ko ni 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 na ni na la ka la mo la nyaado ko di among ko nyaton ko mu yalon ko wala sa korati mu yalon ko beta ta sirine la korra wa ti nyaka iman kuno je ako ate dal wo man ta rato mu ma to wolo ni ti ko to nyaamu mo lo ma ti anno man ke mo di mu yalon ko kuno na dinda ko ti ko ko na ameta je la experience ala ni mu ba keri kon na nyan ta tam mi la mo nyaado ala ni aba ban ko sambala nyaami anda ro ko be ta la ka ta ni ga men ko be la ko ate pare ta le pour ka hani ne ndoni ko mu be ma ko ba pour ka ta mhm abaraka member abaraka um mari so safe ibe mem foke nya wala nyinti ko ite because of an, the, the an experience that you have being an, an an entrepreneur and a ceo of a company you have some transferable skills and you have gone through the process of making um some very difficult decisions in your in your role um how about the um qualification aspect of things because i saw on what's what's up what's on gambia there has been a controversy about um your qualification can you make it clear to gambians what your qualification is yem ne karam yem qualification la soto well i think i've said it in all the platforms that i had that i've worked over 30 years of my life and i've been getting certificates on a lot of things that i've do whatever i do i try to get certified i to have a degree and i don't claim to have a degree last time i checked bill gates doesn't have a degree and he's a multi billionaire it's all about having the base once you have the base of what you want to do you now depending of your iq you know when you have a high iq of course uh, the sky is the limit and i think i've gone all over the world worked all over the world and people work for me and i've run businesses around the world where i think i have those leadership leadership skills where i um, how do you call it uh, run businesses and these experiences life experiences even right now if you want to get a job i don't care if you have a phd if you don't have experience that phd you can hang on the wall 
It's all about life experiences and experiences in the workforce, in the in, in the work environment, you know, and also dealing with people on a daily basis, dealing with staff on a daily basis, regardless whether it is in Gambia or whether it is abroad. So I've done all that. And I think when you talk about qualifications, one has to look at all of that. I mean, the prior um, heads of state that we have, I don't think they even have a quarter of what I have right now. I don't think they have the qualifications that I possess. I mean, um, the fact that I'm even talking to you here and not even, you know, studying or reading a book or whatever, it's already a qualification. I mean, we see our leaders when they talk on platforms, they even having difficulties uh, translating um, certain things to the media or translating that to people. And so far, such would, I think I possess more qualifications uh, when it comes to experience and um, uh, probably from traveling and meeting people and being my own boss all these years that they don't have. They but don't do have. You have I mean, I do you have I somebody? Used, I, hold on, I could have used that qualification probably and get myself a PhD, but then without that, Without the PhD, without the experience, what good is my PhD? Okay, that's that's absolutely that that does make sense actually. Um, what I wanted to say was, um, I know you have a lot of experience traveling and dealing with people, but how about in governance and diplomacy and politics? Do you have any experience, not in terms of learning it in school or in 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 university, in terms of having the physical? Um, work experience of being in, in politics? Do you have any- Okay, any you're asking me that question. It's okay, but last time I checked the president or the people that have been in office, did they have those qualifications trying to be in office? Did Donald Trump have those experiences prior to being in office? Did Obama have those experiences as a leader before being the head of state for the United States? So you cannot um, uh, look at somebody just because maybe I'm a woman and think, okay, you know what, does she have that experience or has she worked in government? I mean, <laughs> the ones we have in the Gambia, none of them worked in government before. And I think probably I'm even more experienced in them because I am part of that government in the sense that I work with them on a daily basis. I work with government to, to, to do projects and stuff and it's not working. I see what's happening on the ground. I live here, I look around me and, I'm part of the government system that is failing right now. So you, when you talk about experience, it's about how you connect yourself in the society to understand what is happening to the people. And I am one of those people that is on ground that is hurting from what is happening right now. So that alone qualifies me to be able to even go up there and be fixed the problem that they cannot see and they cannot fix. Because mm -hmm. they never had the experience I have right, right now to even do what they're supposed to do right now. Right. But one can argue that people like um, contestants like um, um, Halifa Sala and, and, and for example, um, UDPs, we say, no, they have been in, in politics for a long time. They haven't necessarily, we say, no, has served in government. Halifa hasn't. But they have been running their parties for a long time. And one could say that they have experience in, in Well, in, let me in tell politics. You Would you say that... Um, Say that again. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Yeah. So, so that is just if if someone, for argument's sake, if someone is going to compare you with somebody mm -hmm. like Halifa or somebody like Hussein, what would you say to them? Because well, certainly well, they I, do have experience in in the political they have sphere. Experience. Yeah, they have experience. But my problem is, if they are so experienced, then what happens to the collision? Mm. Right. I mean, for me, that says a lot. If all of them have experience, how come when they made the collision, it didn't turn out the way they thought? I mean, with all due respect to them, mm -hmm. but then maybe if they were, I don't know, I don't want to say more than what I just said. Okay. If all that experience and all that knowledge and they all came to, all these powerhouses came together mm -hmm. and the collision failed, what can you say to that? I put that question to the people. Mm -hmm. Okay. Remember, the main kacha can do the role in the intro. Um, the experience going in the kacha, by the bafo kaya na kofati experience sa to governance karol alabang aning aning politiko niy. So ngani halif 
for the compare and in and in Hussein or that many are no whole made of political corners for singing one name thing. If a political young corner between me, Sala Jabby Loying summarized no more yet along. I mean, I mean for what a member. Ah, Kamurun Alatumo and Nimanika Tongola, Takumo therefore, a colon and done all our qualification of Bundayin. Molmunka for PhD in degree, Tatani Mola for. Moja ma wala moja le waso do iba mola manda kunda wala iman do waso re wala ma along ibe la opie di ta manda niya ni ka dan ni mola ban ko mola ko ko wala do itol bulu kon ni mola ba ko la pie di pie di sa apa mola ni ka la wala pa ni mola ba ko la ten ni ten ni ten mu ya lo ko aman ke ko niya apa dala ta mo ni ka bring sanji tan sabo ko na experience ni ko mu so do ana mu karan ban da ba ri mola ko la ni man ta ma man karan kon wo karan wo torong way phd ni biya la le mung different da ani mo mo ni ya lo ko ba phd karo di tongola o ato e mo qualify to even have that degree ni wa phd kana politiko ko lan karo la ka tan ni ka ni ni ka mo na wala ni ni ko po munu ba sirim office b baro e phd so la hani po you know donald trump ni le phd so la hadi wal be kana man sa ke ni la jam kon mo kana je ko mu so la mate ni la to advantage la ka Puru moli hakilo tuo to ba 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 ke. Anin kana ning kumo to yen ning ka muna. Ako ning akara ko experience ni nong anong Gambia 2016 mo be ya kalamuta mungke ta Gambia bangkoka. Anong ya kalipas sala ko politician ke ba ba lang Gambia. Ya usen utabo ko ya aning ning nrp la leader mungke da ahmad pati wol be ke da moti muni alon ko sanji burum burum wol wol be ko man sa kunda e ba do ko la so ni wol le nate bulo ka fu nyo kan itata pour ka ko le sono ko ba de gambian ko lakale aliye la moy bate sang wol le mine deliver gambia banko kan wol ni law experience be kon amanke ko gambia nyanta le kan nyu doya doya ro manyinya nga jibe ate mari mumba bulu ani ani munna da mol ka menoli na lo wala ke da kudi mu yalan ko a important ba ke le dan ka ko ko abate na ma experience lo wala ke ata dum tonga mun ko mun ke problem ti mo ya jibe hada ma dinga sa mun ke no bari kana mo jibe dorom ya jod o ma nyinya nga jibe ate hada ma dinga mumba ko ana ya munna sura do ga menoli bari biya lan ko mata da sanji jelu 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 mo pata ke mo le ko ko na da na da pour ka mun ma ko na la mo ya la nga jan biala andu musole madi bala faso ko andu nga kala muta ko na keda mo la nyaato ko daro bala faso na ban ko kanne ban ko bi da nyaato program badi man ni kala mo la sa kala mo ko nyaato what i what i just want to say is i asked a question i don't know whether that's what you're saying but i'm not hearing that i'm trying to say since you talked about the powerhouses that are more experienced and have been in government or have you know all this. What I'm trying to say, I pose a question to the people with all the experience and the years in so-called politics. How come when they form a collision, it fails? I pose that question to the public. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, I, I think that's clear. That's clear, Maria. I think somebody is responding to that question and saying that because of the lack of qualification, people might have experience uh, but not necessarily the qualification because sometimes you combine the academics with the quality um, with the experience and that 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 makes somebody very substantial and very competent so what we see in the gambia is a lot of these politicians they have experience in running a party and some of them even um have been in in government before but not necessarily like adam Abaro. He, he he doesn't have the qualification academically or even the experience so people are trying to run away from that now so gambians are saying they're not ready to settle in for another candidate that doesn't have the qualification because they don't want to be in in, in another mess basically so what is the qualification of you want to tell me that all these political parties their leaders have a qualification but they cannot come together as one to be form a collision they have experience but not necessarily qualification so they might have finished high school so or the they might have a degree in head of state. Yeah, that's a big question. That's a big question. What is so the qualification for us? All the heads of state that I see around the world, none of them had qualifications. 
it's not written anywhere anyway. But there are certain leadership skills. That's why I started asking you your values and your leadership skills, because there are some traits that we look at, um, we look in a, in a good leader, and, and you have um you have answered that. So moving forward, um, what is what is what are some of your strengths and weaknesses? Well, my strengths are I'm prepared to listen. I'm prepared to listen to the people. It's only when you listen to the people, then you know what they want and then you know what direction to go. I have no problem with criticism because it's part of, you know, like I said, people have different viewpoints. Um, people are, we are all opinionated, so we have to accept that, hey, my view might not be somebody else's view. So I, I accept that as a Gambian, and for the Gambia, I am a woman of Africa, and I'm very proud of that. And I am, you know, I am open to all of that. So I'm not, um, my strength is always to listen. My strength is always, you know, I have no fear for criticism at all. And I love to listen to people. I take guidance from that also add what I know with my experience and hopefully, you know, make a better leader. Thank you. Remember? Thank you. 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 Weakness my weakness is when I see um, poverty, when I see people and I cannot help them. You know, that is a weakness for me because, like I said, I, I don't like um, to see people suffer when there is not necessary for them to suffer. So that touches me and it, 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 it's a big deal for me because then I can't sleep. I lay in bed all night thinking how I can help. So my weakness is, you know, humanity itself, you know, how to help on, on a daily basis, how to help and give back. Akamumpo nina ko wala nindi ko ate mambambang karomo na ani mumpa patandila wala nindi ko adamadiya karola muni along ko twenty bulu waro long alaste mapela andami mapeno ako kita ju pupi pumi along ko a woka niyo tora bakel anadila alasudo ake mira wala bakel bale adamadingo isaje no bata ko nila ka mapela ima mapeno isa isa mong daron daron sa diya wala nindi ko ni piyani Wolong ala weakness or karoti, or Hadamatimon, Gambia Bantal of Poti Salong, the Kalamuka Oya. Obaraka. Abaraka member, your silang um, last question on the personal aspect is um, who inspired you, Marie, to, to, to go into politics? Jumalem, we tell a role model, T. Jumale. Well, um, yeah, Tina, you Jumale, you Jumale inspire. Yeah, the people that inspire me are the people I work with all the time. You know, the young people that are on with me, the, the, the women, even some of the men that work with me, they inspire me to get into politics. You know, my great inspiration came as well from my own mother that brought me to this earth. And she has worked, lived and died here. And I have to also look at her life and think about what I can do to change, you know, what happened to her. For example, she died of lung cancer. She never smoked. So, um, you know, things like that. And she died on a, uh, on a very um, serious note where, you know, she was being operated on and they never did it properly. So um, it formed pockets in her lungs. And we had to bring her to the U.S. to die there. And when they realized that they, they, they didn't do it right and she had pockets, it became very sad because it made the operation in the U.S. even uh, more difficult. So when I look back on all this and then look at the people I'm working with, the youth, the mothers, the people in general in Gambia, this motivated me to get into politics and make a change, especially with the area that I mentioned, which is education and health and all that. So my mom died from lack of uh, proper health system. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sorry about your mom, Marie. I'm so sorry about her. Mm -hmm. Remember, 
ka muntan di molla ko ase lotale gir ka tan di molla ko yutol ni ponito ni musol ni mulla tina pur ka insembo da ka lo ko aba ma se la polo polo la mun to wolong wulu la ni mun ke ta ba ma ti ko palan ke ta moti mun ya sembo ni ki ala pur ka lo ka ke nya tun ko ti ni banko kan bayri ni aji be wo ay do ko ke janne ala fata ko do ko wala ko anata saka so ko mu mo be ala ka ko mun na ko kansa andu mo le ala ne ko na health system o gambe jang amam be ti ala operation o ta operation o mi ala ko amam ni na ta ala ka ta nyami ala na ta ke ke ta ta america ala na ta min dio jo do ya ndi je ko no be na ta tin na ka hamo di ala ati muso ati ta muso te du ka gambe no kuni sino mu ne ba sino kan ka tan ni molla ko a mu bakere na banko kan amanyan so ate won amo ni dino na sawla lande pour ka ke nya ton ko di bayri ni na ral officio de ka fondi ke wol doro ne ta radio kon ko doro doro nya ka tan la ga men la ko amo ni bi di ani ji ko ba la karola mun sa tan ni gambe en be la ko na lo ra aba fali mo na dilla fali mo ya lan ko be meta wole ni ni la ni gambe banko kan wala ke ral ko makam Apara ka apara ka memba sila ngana dum mari la ti mo fango to nka be doman 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 be dun na politi ko fango kono ne am kana ji be nga young people ol jele ya mem bu ko ite fango am mari ya fu ko young people ol la te san san bitum mari sa fo no nyele am mari isa fo no nyele juma le be mari ko ma juma le be mari la ti mo kono bari interview jama ali men ke ngete dab male je bi nga memba jele Bitu jumal le bako ma mamme no je folo. Everyone is here, you know, like I said, I have a bunch of youth, a uh, very powerful youth who've been in the system, political system in the, you know, in the Gambia, they've been around political leaders for a very long time and they were left behind, you know. They were never considered after the the leaders were elected. And then I have elders as well. We have elders in our team as well who the same thing happened to them and some of them are past retirement age and they want to give back to the youth. So we have a very diverse group um, that are ready to come forward and take this country forward. And we have people coming from all over, like I said, from different parties and stuff. And to stress, like I said, I call for unity. I call for everybody to come. and people are coming and this is what is forming our team ah na long kabriya nyini ka kumolo kumo ya dele ba ke bari molo molo la ani molo mira am ko mo kilo mo le jeje mo kilin ta jang mo be le bijan juto gambia funding ke wol be le bijan mo mo ni ya long ko ima kala mo to nyama isa kala mo to nyama bari jam mo ni na interview la ka tan ni la ko ini ka re da mala are da mala nya ta nya ta bolo ko ni ka mo be pindi ni no machallah ibara na ko to nya to nya to nya cha han kuma mo si jam anu pandi ke wol meta politiko ko no pandi ke wol ya politiko ta le ya ke bi su kuma to bari ni ya ji be e ka mo feale ni ki ton si ta ya mo fay karaba bu ya non ko ama ni nya so won da mo mo le na ta ka kam be mo ke pour mo le ke kilimo di na de tam be ni to nya kam ba anu ana ta pandi ana ta ke bal falan so al fal mo nya lan ko e ba no ma to nya la al fal mo nya lan ko e do falan feale da stress kan ka bu ya ma gafna so do e fay an mo bi ala ne ko tan fal ne wulu la le bata ni sa de kon kon bi ni wol na ta si ko ba ni musul ni mo le tan de la kon da men wol sa lan ko ci pole ci a man ke ko ni ki to wol ta ko ma ay funding ke wo mo so do ma sha allah ni a ta tan lan ko si bam bari nga lon ko wato da taro ye bari fonni ko do wato ko ma mol gambe no be o lon ko bari ko dem fonni ke wol mo dinni merene de yende na wata yende ci ko so la jela ko fe a ko ma do si jam fonni ke wol na fa wuli la le fonni ke wol na fa kam so la la banko kan ne fonni ke wol ma la fi ka tar si campel to ka tay wala ate a mi fonni ke wol ma la fi ka tar ko ma ko dege la ko sa tan ni gambe ya banko be la ko do fonni ke wol na fa right le tala mu mu na right are you sure you are still translating what i said yes i'm translating the same thing he's 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 adding salt and salt and sugar or salt and maggi okay remember is a good pr comme mol mol sa kalmo to nyama ko fonni to ba ko mo ne ka marida ma nya na je 
television or Rakada Mania, I get in the net or Hamanda Kopan in Dota Koma, Mosa Loko, Puning K, Mili 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 a baraka bari hani bi de follow up la wo wo nyirin karola parce hani bi marima fo molie alpha killing one prominent alpha member to coma lafta ka to killing no moy hana be kira mo killing net ay mo killing to fo molie member to com just one prominent name mari one elderly person or one young person who is prominent that we can say ah i know that person and and because of that person i would i would support money can you give us one name No. <laughs> when you come to my office, you will see all that you want to see. That's why I invite people to come in. <laughs> but I'm far away. I cannot come to your office, Marie. <laughs> <laughs> I have I have seen that you're very close to um Aji Dafe, Aji Kumba. Is she behind you? Yeah. Well, we're all sisters. We're all right. sisters. Yeah. Mm. We all okay. sisters. And when we talk about empowering women, you know, we all come together as women and empower each other. Right. Okay, so I see that you don't want to share share names at the moment, and I'll leave that at that. And I'll go on to ask about consultation now, because you said you have a wide range of youth and, 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 and women behind you. Did you, at any point, since you made this announcement that you want to become president, did you make any sort of consultation with stakeholders, including political parties and, and local communities. Did you go around to talk to people? Well, we are not, you know, we, we are, um, I announced that I'm an aspiring presidential candidate. Mm -hmm. And we've been working with the media, trying to give all the media platform for the whole month and a half. And what we are trying to do, we have scheduled everything between now and December, a lot of, a lot of things are gonna happen. And then you talk about next year. So we have an agenda that we are following right now. And eventually people will see all of that coming up. Like I said, I cannot share our ticket because as we speak, people are beginning to imitate and copy. So we have to you know, hold back on some of the things. I'm sorry about that. Okay. Yeah. Kalamudan <laughs> Silala, a baby na and a balbe kalamutanila, mumba tato, animuya tina adiketa a lot of kake and the devil can be a bamboka. Bari alma miracle mari um woto it fintita ifo ilaftale nyim party doli endorse. Wana take controversy back at a moti by the modul ya ham yaming and it may be te ya min mena manki kilinti. Sila yaf yit and dinajan neko consultation jama manke follow. Um, and do you talk well after the world yet endorse? Between Maria Mira, what do you like to assassin and demolier me mean by endorsing you? Because I, I, as I said, it brought a lot of controversy in the media. Yeah, and people didn't quite, I think people's own um, understanding of, of endorsement was different from where you were coming from. Can you tell us what that endorsement yeah. means? Yeah. Well, if you have a society that is divided, you know, and you have political parties where there's so much, so many political parties and so much division as far as political colors and tribes and all. Then you have one entity or one person that comes who's not, you know, into um, all these political parties. And he, she, she's one person who is um, from multi uh, tribes, you know, I'm from different tribes. And then uh, when it comes to religion, half of my family is Muslim, half is Christian. Then you talk about colors. If you want to unite everyone, then you have to be that individual that is not affiliated. And when you say endorse, they all have to see me and say, you know what, she's right. For us to come together as one, for us to be able to fix this country, let us endorse her. We accept what she says. What she says is right. We need to unite. 
I know a lot of them will not accept that because they want to be heads of state. They want to sit in that seat. And we, that's fine, but that will not change the dynamics in our society today. Um, and and, and it, it cannot help the Gambians. You know, we had a collision before and the collision didn't work because everybody forgot about what they signed. So when I say endorse, endorse somebody that is not affiliated neither by tribe, nor by color, nor by region to anybody. And that way we can work together. If I go into office today, for example, I don't have problems with working with anybody regardless of whatever political party you come from. As long as you can work, as long as you can work, I'm okay. If I'm calling for unity, I should be able to work with everybody. I, if I see that so-and-so is a good guy and he's doing his work, I don't care what party he's from. I'm not gonna look at that. I'm gonna take him because I know with that guy, this section or this part will work, you know, will will he will do good on that, you know, mm -hmm. and that is how I think. But of course, our mentality or our Mental, um, how do you call it? Uh, the way we are wired, or if people are wired in Gambia, it's not up to that level yet. And I understand that. But I hope to pray that if the leaders are not coming, that their people will understand and start to come so we can fix this country. It's not about colors, it's not about tribe, it's not about religion. It's about coming together as one. You cannot promote that we are one Gambia, but then still be separated. It doesn't work like that. Okay, Mary. Um, Jenny member, Jenny, if I would like translate, like maybe it's a base summarize. You're gonna follow up quick one on the situation. Um, Mary, what you just said to me now, for me, it looks like you are um, you are advocating that they leave their parties and join you. No, no, they have their party. They have they their accept party. Accept you. They you have to accept you. They have to but accepting you, accepting you means they would have to, they can't accept you and still have their political parties running because that would be contradictory. No, that will not. If you say, let's say, for example, member has his own political party and member sees that what I'm saying is what's going to bring the Gambia together. Member can say, yes, I endorse Marisol and I want us to rally behind her so she can leave. Now, when she leaves, that doesn't mean that we are, you understand, we still have our party, we still have our party members. Now, when she leaves, because she's trying to do the right thing and everybody endorses her. Now, when I say, when I sit in office, I'm willing to work with everybody. It might be complicated to understand. If I say, when I sit in office, let's say, for example, member color is white, for example, and, you know, member decides to endorse me. This has nothing to do with any political party right now. I'm just giving you scenarios. Now, when I am in office and member endorses me, that one endorses me, that one endorses me, I'm willing to work with whoever they have that qualifies to work in the office. Some of them already have people even working in the office already. Mm. And those people, I'm willing to continue working with them because I see what they are doing. So it has nothing to do with party. And don't think it doesn't mean they, they break their parties. No, 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 no. And don't think mean, meaning just saying, yes, she's right. Let us bring, break this political divide. Right. We need to break this political divide. Well, if they don't understand that too, that is fine. Like I said, that is fine. But then what they are, what they're promoting, one Gambia, it is not true in their heart. It is not true. It is not true at all. Right. Remember, I would like to, would like to um, summarize more than Manika Kamala, because not follow up door for answer to water. Okay. I come on. 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 I <laughs> It is about unity. The only thing that is the same. All the people that are the political divide movement, all the people who are the political party, 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 all the people who are the political
because the moment you die as a political party leader, nga fa ko ngamari endorse le wala ngamari accept le wo mol ba jele nyaame wolen ko e sila nyine be UDP for example aka e mari le endorse sila wo to ba jele le ko bitu wo UDP supporter supporter maybe wol bi ne te fanan support la le wol ba wo jele wala nyaama sa fe te ba wala mol tala wol bulo ko le and wol fanan te la fila wala by the competition wala mi te be la fri men na wol fanan be la fri wala do you get me mari no i'm i don't get you, can, you don't you understand that for yeah okay. So, so what I'm, uh -huh. what I'm saying is, um, if I was, I'm giving you a scenario, for example, I was a UDP party leader and I said, well, I accept Mary and I endorse her. Some of the supporters of UDP may take that as um, an, an, a support to you and they might divert and come and support you instead. And because politics is all about competition, you are all wanting to be president, um, you, me endorsing you as a UDP candidate would mean that some of my supporters would, would support you, which means that I will lose that support from those people. And that would not be beneficial for me because I do need those, those votes as well. So even the statement of accepting, saying that we accept Mary, is not competitive and it's not beneficial for the other parties to well, do. This is why the competition comes out of it. If we want to unite Gambia, then the competition comes out of it. But if you are looking that you want to sit as a president, of course you will not endorse me. Because by endorsing me, you are telling your people, listen, this woman is the only one that can change the Gambia so that we can be united again. We're going to put our vote on her for this election so that Gambia can change. That's what endorsement is. By you saying that, of course, when election comes, they're going to vote for me. That way, it, it, what it does, it separates that divide. But of course, if they're going to compete with me, it will not happen, just like you said. I mean, it's, I, I think that makes it clear. You understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if it's a competition, if it, I don't have a political party, mm -hmm. and I refuse to set up a political party right now, that's why I stand up as an independent candidate, so that mm -hmm. they don't say, oh, you know what? She's affiliated with this party. Oh, no, she's from this party. Or she has a party, and her party is full of a, 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 a Mandingo, or her party is full of Jola, or her party is full of uh, Fula. So this is one of the reasons I stand alone, and I'm standing alone to invite everybody to come, and that is what endorsement means. Yes, if, if, if the party leader endorses me, then of course, he, they will say, you know what, put her weight on her. You know, let us all put her, our weight on her, because if we call for one unity, and this woman doesn't care whether you are Fula or Jola or Mandingo or so, she just wants to unite, then let us put a weight on that, knowing that your members, everybody will have a place to work in the office so that we can take the country forward. On the next elections coming, then we can now do again our competition. But we need to start breaking that because we have over 15 political parties. 15, over 15. That is too much for a small country like Gambia. And how do you call unity? Yes, of course. It's People will say, or people will say, ah, this woman is there. But I just feel that that is the only way to break that barrier of the norm. But don't you think if they all endorse you, there wouldn't be any competition then, Mary? Who would you be contesting against them? There will be no competition. <laughs> so everybody. <laughs> and they all I won. like that. I like that. Okay. <laughs> so what would you get only mm. one? And now mm. we move, and in the office, that is when now we select, and we select, we make sure everybody will work together, we come together as one. We, Gambia, listen, uh, my sister, Gambia is so behind right now, and we see where Gambia is going. You understand? And we cannot stay divided because of our party colors or our tribes. You understand? Mm. We need to start working together as a team. And in order for do that, somebody has to break that yoke. Somebody has to break that yoke. Mm -hmm. 
Yo, member, member, what do you for? Ngamila jindu la tonte da for no la je bayri. Adu la controversy si asa je bake. But it's like, it is a bombardi wale do nga ibo for what do you Nga comment so di beja ne. Nga jele ko nyim party, nyim party supporter dol bi je bedi amu kanjane already. Kwa kuma jama ako. But afu moli a mem for jorong nyin laba wala den nga move on. Yalom, yalom gambi ya, diya mota bae la. Molten is rolled by a lot of more by like Bomin for the Dapon, or very Hanamas of a group of democracy or wrong. The right be more bail and a very yellow bail and life like that they implement the Yami. So, Kako Molyako, another Karumbuna, Yalom, someone in Dividale, is a is a Matita Angale Kamako, Mobima Angale Mo, Yena Manika Kamala, Mobima Manika Kamo, Mosa Kaman in Kori, Momanika Kamo, Mosa Kaman in Port Katam for body, hold the woman in Katama in Italona. Mosi and Lamueni had to go back at Kapoko. I don't want now competition. Nadi, Nia Jalona Faye, Nina Nitiko, and then Menor Bekama Silla second Sika de Santo. Very Nico Nico independent, Mobe Kairos Rafael. For Wokamala, Minkanama Dunata, a new Hakilo, and Amira Kuno Mialonga Sonia Dale, Kapoko, Mota and those are one of Moti Latin. It's a important competition of one of the Mobea and those. New Mobea and those, then they Kairos. Paski amun kule tu mian lang ko mudi kairo yada na bana so ni political party dia lang niyo kaya dia la gamit dia na lepo kapare para madimo dia mul na mo ibake yaya la kumo mo i kana adar na jibe gorong yaya jibe mung kabar na ko kaya di alay hatulo di mo la lepo na mo iro kon mal gamit ang call day dani la ka tangi la ko yung musim ni mo na ta kairo la yaya la kumo la mo ibake ani ima understand sa mo ni ni ta mo ni 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 ta walang para madiya kon kairo la nati women so women empowerment follow follow what does it mean to you, Mary, when we when you say women's empowerment, you're here for women. What does it mean to you? Well, um, what women empowerment means to me, I want women to, this is the 21st century, and we want women to all come out because um, you know, to um, how do you call it, to to show off what they can do. You understand? You know, when you talk about women empowerment, you're also talking about economic empowerment for women you know political empowerment women are the ones that go out there they vote women are the ones that are out there fixing everything so we need to take that to the next level where they understand that their voice is powerful you know their voice and decision making they need to be part of the decision making you cannot have a room full of men making decisions for women you understand so this is where women have to be involved in politics Women have to be in, you know, uh, involved in the economic development of this country. You understand? And these are all areas that we need to start empowering our women to get out of that norm. Because yes, we can still go home. Listen, we go to work. Some of us go to work. From work, we go to the house. From house, we cook, still cook lunch, still cook dinner, and we still wake up and still go back to work. So how do you empower them that they get to the next level? You empower them to get to the next level by involving them, getting them involved in politics, getting them involved in the economic development of the country, getting them in, involved even in the cultural uh, um, area of our society, you know? And by us, one or two women that have the voice, we, we, try to give that voice out and show women that, hey, the, those days are over where we're just supposed to cooking and cleaning. You know, those days are over. And when you have a woman winning, when a woman wins, really, everybody wins. You know that, you know. I always tell people, um, every man, when every man, there is no man on this earth that is not born from a woman. I've not seen it yet. Mm -hmm. How about yeah. I remember? Kana kana yan yun ka muna walang musol la karola at hindi la ko at iba solo la world o bayri yung gamit ng jibe musol ba bata punto mulung kita na bulu lalti yan yung ba kung masala walang bulu o karol do lang ika bata punta yan yung ba bulu la lokano do mulo yung ayale si pamun pa natal do ni nara musol la karol ito le bida parsebo ni nara musol la karol ito le kada bulu o kono ni nara musol la karol 
itol debata biro kela suwa kono itolom binda anoldi itolom kobedi kono bala fa anyo wara kala kuro hani bi e karo bata kono kobeda rakuwa kono na muya alonko akala fa tani lata mino bi lako alata na musol fala ye panje ka tani lako e fala ye kamo sara nyi bangko kang e fala ye tara a gambia la ekonomi bunda karo la bunda tani ko aba increase nya min kon musol ala fata ni la la ko ala sembo ala tole jela ay lo gambia bangko ka kumo la subia kam yeah baraka bake just to follow on 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 that same um topic i economic empowerment for the um in terms of poverty among women um i i on the representation for her because i think you talked about uh, women joining into politics and those are real issues gambian women are facing um let's now talk about things that people don't talk about the taboo subjects you know when we talk about polygamy for example we talk about inheritance law for example we talk about um fgm domestic abuse these things are issues that women are facing on a daily basis and um a lot of of politicians from, from i'm speaking from a feminist point of view because i'm a feminist and i did say that this interview is going to focus a little bit um i want to spend a little time to get to see your understanding of these issues that people don't talk about and is affecting women every day um what are you ready to do mary about these things for example what sort of um laws already we have laws but in terms of implementation if you become a president um let's just take one scenario of domestic abuse what sort of strategies are you going to put in place to make sure that these things are not happening or in fact they are because they would happen i know that but in fact they are um lowered in a, in, in such a way that people women would feel safe in in their homes what sort of strategies are you planning to put in place well that is one of the reasons and you can it is one of the reasons i was talking about involving women when you talk about empowerment you can you, you need to involve women in the political arena you need to involve women in these offices these decisions that are being made on behalf of women are mostly made by men and mm -hmm. i think if women are well positioned then they can now uh, have laws and and policies that can protect them i you might think that i'm all you know all that i came from an abusive marriage i had a very abusive marriage in the us and yeah. i know how it feels to be abused you know and mentally because there's all kinds of ways people don't understand when it uh, when you talk about abuse they think abuse is when you you know hit a woman no you can have mental abuse or physical abuse uh, you know and these are all types different types of abuse so but when you have women in offices or when you have women as part of a decision making body it helps to also understand they understand what they're going through they understand what other women are going through to be able to bring those policies out or those um honey quality so that those women can be protected their rights can be protected as far as uh, um, all this polygamous marriage where a woman cannot give a child because you know you cannot have a child then we divorce you or because you know you have a child the child died and then you're like oh she's a woman she can born again you know these are that's the mental abuse right there you know mm -hmm. if you're married and you cannot have a child it's not um you know sometimes destiny you know god decides who I can have a child or not you know and these are all like i said the decision making body has to have women involved in this policy making and these uh, uh, laws Mm -hmm. If you look at back in the day all the people that made these laws and policies were men. Mm -hmm. And we need to change the narrative. This is one of the so reasons we... to empower women you need to mm -hmm. uh, strategically place them in the economic development of the country in the political uh, uh, area of this country society all of that women have to be involved. Mm -hmm. So are we looking at a feminist government then are we looking at a government where there are more representation in parliament um women representation in parliament and in cabinet yes, is that what we're, we're looking at with marisol we're gonna balance the scale because our men also don't listen as much as women get abused men do get abused too let me put that to you men do get abused so i've been in that arena where i've seen both sides so but we have to have a balance we have to have at least a 50-50 balance where the voices can be heard from both so it's not a feminist thing because like if i'm talking about youth youth do comprise of boys men growing up and they need to start learning and understanding these things you understand 
So it's not about, no, there's a feminist thing. It's more about getting women involved, especially in certain decision making that can affect their lives. Well, that's what feminism is all about. It's about giving equal opportunities, isn't it? It's, it's that's what because the term itself, people you know, don't want to associate you know, themselves with. Like when you talk about feminism, people think, oh, feminism is all about just the woman, woman, woman. So we need to yeah. break it down so people can understand what feminism really means. It's not about just women. It's about equal opportunities for women. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, absolutely, that's right. Um, so remember, I'm a time or delay for Molly because we must all last seven to your call of work. By the Niagi Bay Gambia, um, would all be a political party or Jamaja my book a catcher coming to Niagi Bay Ying a domestic abuse co and you may alone for all them physical or emotional. You must boot a okay, I must water car boot a wall of car abuse psychologically, wall of financial abuse from a book a catcher back. I've been doing a book called Connolly, but it didn't have a real law. Must also pull a political party no more for a better body in cool many are long point well if our commercial impact at home okay but on this work on a book at kacha so i'm a ring in in car well the nata nata i've been winning killer um kawataka falling now we want just one example let's because uh example jama do for them being a member meant at a new inheritance school a man along for commercial car um can learn inherit you know, ni came out fat and I didn't know what came out fat and came by school. Connor, a book, a book, a part shot or con rack on a cotton key. So, new muko let him may along for new muso fit it. I got a lot of musole. Fonsa, yinin kaka, jibe, a tame money plan soto, kamusol bonding in collier, quarter, be menkon. So, nisa la jabby law for no molly, um, then not a frosty. Okay, now I'm going to be put down low so natal and the world for yachty. Mosolmo <laughs> Setting up a la Wulu, Yaja Pupon of Pumia Lampo, a man yang, and don't eat Musoni never do a half five. Mina Kawaya, a cafe and data la Pudo. From Munana being told the phone, don't hold up for Musota, a Kelandi Karala Katanila Po, Imana Pada, or Napada, so that you sat upon. Wolekala Hapo, Wokala, Nipia, and Balapati, Puruka Wuli, Katanigan Via Muso de la Po, Adenatale, Kalo, Puruka, Dimina, Bundi, Mumbe, Dolkan, Ningam Via Bangkoka. Very a polyatal, Musul, Nia Gibe, if a political cono, a meta political cono, very honey bee, Nia Gibe, a mana pata on a paras of a day, a demolus carambo and do a foyji the honey bee, the Mondo Musa no Mansa Punda, on the meter of Mansa Punda, no Maka woman Sapunda, Mandra Pukitan in the Mole, on Namira Po, Nimona, the Puruka Marco, is a Yen Bunda Yelai, Puru, Musul Babolano, Batakon and Yan, very near Ikema Banda. It is a rakono, jelly illustrated. Me not here by what's called rakono. Nagilapo, a manina, a monkey put in me alonco, and in the gala or yam. Con Musonian da Camosola Sadecono, Musonian da Camosola Suocono, Musonian da Camosola, Gambia, Pampoca, Walekata, the Simfa Daddy, Barico Simfa Dow, Simfa Da, Simfa killing the Fulo Canada, Nipula Yamabala. What I had in Simfa Data, Purkanan in Pagaboli, Gambia. Musolu kam program de musolu de sa kalamuda ko inyong musolu wulita k ila karo fight ka kelo k kelo musa tina ko do kalamuda sa kalamuda kan de kompo. Abala ka ba? Abala ka? Abala ka member? Ambe time mo jibe ka na we've spent nearly an hour and I, I I haven't even asked half of my questions yet so I'm gonna try to speed things up here. Do you want to take a break, Maria, and have a sip of water and come back again? Yeah, I need a sip of water. Yes, yes, I think I do need as well. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay. Shall we carry on? Yeah. 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 Okay. So um, we've talked about um, women's empowerment, and I think you sort of have a plan um, by increasing women's representation in in all spheres basically and you feel that that would solve most of the problems that they are facing at home so let's move on to youth empowerment now um member is one of your team members and you did say that the youth actually inspired you and motivated you to 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 um 
go into politics. What plans do you, first of all, what are some of the issues you, 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 um, you know that are facing uh, youths in the Gambia right now? Well, the youths have a lot of issues because uh, there is no inclusive. You know, the youth are the youth are not being included in a lot of decision making. The youth are not um, talked about. Um, you have a lot of issues right now as far as unemployment. You have a lot of issues of even the education. Some of them are dropping out of school because the parents cannot pay, so they end up um, being out there trying to fend so that they can help their parents um, feed them. You know, and then, um, you know, the, 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 how do you call it, the depression, the depression, we might ignore that word depression, but there's a big depression in the youth uh, in society. You know, when you do go to the um, heart of where the youth are and you sit with them and they talk to you, I mean, you might not have, you know, unless you don't have a heart. You know, you will not listen to them. And then these are one of the reasons where they think that the solution is leaving the country and going to, to another country. And mm -hmm. they don't understand that when they leave this country and go to another country, uh, mm -hmm. the worst awaits them. You know, some of them get lucky, but not all of them get lucky. And in order for us to um, eliminate that is to understand mm -hmm. their plight and see how we can include them in some of this decision making, include them and also um, and, and see you know, see what they need, what they want, and what they need is two different things. Mm -hmm. So it stems from the basis. What is the basis? Our educational system. Mm -hmm. When you are dropout, you basically in the Gambia have no future. Even when you go to university, you still come out and don't have a job. So imagine you go to the University of the Gambia, where probably you have been standing because the rooms are full. Mm -hmm. or the college and we are standing there hours and hours and the rooms are full and you graduate and then you still can't find a job. The mm -hmm. mental depression that is causing to you, then you talk about the ones that could not even go to that level. Mm -hmm. Then you talk about there's a whole other sector that went to the Islamic school like the Quranic school. Mm -hmm. They tell you, oh, we learned um, a new Dara Lengyanda, why there's no you know, further education. So these are all the uh, issues that we need to look at and then see how to fix that. And these are all the things that I have in my manifesto moving forward. Yeah, but I come back and marry. Um, I'm going to come and 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 I'm going to come dol <laughs> wala ñi ndiko ka tan ni mo la ko koy kumbo parce que ka kuma ka mo mo koy ani la balu nya ba nya mi ngam dia ba ngo ka apala fa wara ta bari nya je bi ko ni ko la wula ka ta pa ni le ba ko sul la ko lay ila ko ma ñi ne man bete ya pa ke la ko ma ne man bam bam an ni ki mo so ko so ni ba ko ka bari ko ni ko mo basiri ita ra school ko yi dire man do ko so university student on basiri hani bi man do ko so do ko mo sa tan ni ko if I am from Munapano, Kono Veda Rako, Kono Muyat in a quarter for a little group for Ninka Wolde, Kuruka Batata Wolde. Your bidding I do Kupalia for Le, Kupondin Kel Mandoku Soto, I drop drop our co for the Kome Bukakaramobang, um, an infant monkey monkey may include decision making or Kono. So funding Kel Dal Gambe, Loma Loma or La Jama Jama. Say, Maria Mune plan sort of funding Kelly, because one thing is knowing the issues, and another thing is having a, a proper strategy to, to support um, young part people. Part of my manifesto. Ha, yes. But it's a domain for no more, yeah, Jelly Bank, or it be Hannah Treba domain, they just on the surface, car for more, yeah. Right now, we have manifestos that are 20, 30 years old and they're waiting to edit. And right now, I think I've spoken a lot on the media. 
And if I talk about the issues, that means I know what is on ground. And even though I'm talking about them, you have already people picking from that to kind of know what is going to happen to change that. And what I don't like is when people use this to try to get both because they're like, oh, okay, this is what she's working on. And then they're going to now use the same context trying to get people to come, but then can they implement it? There's one thing, knowing the problem. There's another thing, writing a beautiful write-up. And there's a third thing, being able to implement. Isn't that, isn't that you no being competitive now, Marie? Because if you're saying that you don't want to be competitive and now you don't want anybody to know your no. strategies no, 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 because no, 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 you don't want not, them to spy. I'm not being competitive because my manifesto is not done yet. I'm working on it. One, two, when they join in, when they all come aboard, they'll see what I have. And this is a roadmap that can fix the country. And it's simple. It's very simple as ABC, where we can take the Gambia forward. I'm not being competitive in the sense that I'm being, um, how do you call it? They are being competitive. You understand? Right mm -hmm. now, they're being competitive. So to compete with me, they can use this and use that against me, which was not there before. Because we've heard all these parties before. They all spoke before about their policies because they are all mm -hmm. established parties. So if they come up with anything new, people need to start listening and see, okay, they're coming with something new. Where did they get that from? Because you cannot just overnight start changing your policies or start changing your, your how do you call it, your manifestos or the, the way you're talking. You already told people what you can do for the country. And this is one of the reasons people like me have the, the road or the loophole to come in. But Marie, don't you think um, just touching on the surface would, would benefit your campaign at a very early stage, because if people like me are sitting and saying, okay, she's talking about youth empowerment and women's empowerment, but she didn't actually, um, she didn't actually highlight any solution at all, you know, that, that would not motivate me to support you because I need to hear something. You know, I know that the, the campaign is far, far away. It's not even 2021 yet, but people, I think that's what the mistake that politicians make. They wait until the last minute and start talking to people. I feel that people need to hear things and start digesting them and understanding them and comparing you with other politicians. Well, well, well. Miss Baji, I'm gonna show you something. I mean, when you, you, you are sitting right now, I can turn the camera I, and you can see the youth that are sitting there. These are the ones that are editing the, the manifesto. I think if the manifesto didn't have anything for them in there, they wouldn't even bother be sitting here right now. I can turn the camera so you see them, they're all sitting here and they are the ones editing the manifesto that I prepared for them. So mm -hmm. for, for people to say that, that just, it, it, if I said I'm an aspiring candidate, that means I'm working on everything. And prior to the campaign, it will all come out. But you mm -hmm. also have to allow me to be able to have that. And I think member will not be sitting here being so over emotional when he talks because he's not even talking about what I'm talking. If he was direct translating, if he was mm -hmm. just a translator, it, he will be saying exactly what I'm saying. But I see that he's even, even though my manure is not that clear, I see that he's even going on overboard that I want to kick him. But it's because he's sitting there as well and he's editing the manifesto and he sees what is in there and he's getting kind of emotional about it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I get that. I get that. But I get a lot of people also telling me that they 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 still don't hear a solution so maybe what i was expecting to hear was maybe you tell me okay youth unemployment um we are looking at building something building a technical school you're not going into detail well, you're just in our platform if you said you did your money i'm not going to go into detail right now i'm not going to go into detail right now i'm not going to go into detail right now i'm not going to go into detail right now i'm not going to go into detail right now <laughs> you did your research on all my other platforms. I talk about, um, uh, how do you call it, uh, technology integration. I talk about um, changing the school system. I talk about, you know, I mean, to the system where even we have food in the, in the schools. I talk about, you know, um, um, how do you call it, back to school, people that are dropouts going back to school. I talk about a lot of things on all my platforms. You know, but I don't want to keep repeating myself because these other people are going to, you know, we have over 15 parties that are coming up. They're going to steal your ideas. Okay, Mepa, need a solution. Then tell me, like, menu for tenting. Is that you call young people or fan of menu be jibe or la wolf and anxiety before you be relate no la with money? Come on, young solution on menu for cate or a hakiro cono, while I'm a manifesto cono, I be menu do cooking right now. Okay, through Mosa Kalamuta Wanyama. I come up for your wall and don't for me. Your Naja Honeybee, the Nathan Office of Honor, Napoleon Manifesto for Mamuya Longo, and Yapa, 
and on the Nyaro Tabo or the Gandela Nyaro Tabo or Pari Alacumo la Suria Camola Nimico, Atacumo for La Puma Mialanco, and it be a Padrubo Cane, Mampare for the Dolor Manifesto Ni, Edic Gang, Mialanca, Correta, Moncore, Purca La Paji, Contru can be uncool, they say La Pavola, Pari Eta, a fourth seller, Pacumo Bona Dacono, Mialanco, Amanta de Polo, so Tabiro Dunta de Fire from Kiva Mosla, a very fire for the Vienna. A yekal mobe si ya domo. So no tagiro dum mam pare dum mal laiba goni la puru mole odom. Ariyo mai la kodi. Okay, so let's move on um to to the politics now and the economy. Um, first of all, Mari moja ma ko muna tina ite ko mole nga endorsement ko ofali. But isi la muna tina Gambia no nyanta consider puru ke vote kete 2021 ni nata yila candidacy ke already. Muna tina mole be la party bula la yenete ya vote yete vote in. Yeah, Mo. Then why should Gambians consider voting for me? Uh huh. Okay. Because I am for about and about all inclusion. I believe that you know there's no prejudice and I'm not excluding anyone. You know, I want to fight and uphold the constitution. I want to be part of a progressive change to lead this country to economic and social reform. I also am the mother of the nation. I see myself as the mother of the nation so that I can embrace all and we can come together as one so that we can fix this country. Mm -hmm. But I can remember. Ah, come, I am Munko Jan, come, Atela Lo Kamala, all of you to call Kana, Kalinduro, Muketa, Gambia, Bangkok, and Nikola, all mean cool, Gomunia, Lonko, Mantara Tembery, Puruka, Dena, Dinan, Katemi Mole, the Gambian Lul, Kurungam Pongosoto, Wala Nitiko, Wala Dina, Atena, and a very near Gambia. Gambia. Nakuja Malbi Munia Lonko, if it is like a Wapikan, and will be a Nazi, the Pok Ainan, and I will be a Nazi. Gambia no lie that in a Gambian Kayati. By it be near Jibe, Pujamava Kerry, Nini Mantakunda Falinda, Atela Mantakunda, Doku Bale Sokola, Kana, who poor Dolta, Mulmunia Lumpo, the only one who put Kerry in the state cottage, Kamun and Gambian or Kam, Munketa Gambian or Pomotati. So Malum Mia Hamendi from Muyatna. Yo, Silanga, Longa Pananga, interview Jamal Ben Beke, Maria Fujeloko, Itemo Social Democrat, let's Wolamila political ideology. And when you get a time to mea long ko Gambian Jama, um, Ima Tam, you understand. Na socialism lo ne by the um PDOIS mo socialist party leti, but it's still a way more social democrat leti. It's not for no more than the social democracy, man. It's actually the alliance of social democrats. You know, um, when you talk about um, social democrats, it's not actually socialism. We need to separate the two. These are two different things. You know, mm -hmm. we you understand because to be a socialist is completely different from being a social democrat. And when, when we talk about um, things about you know uh, ensuring workers' rights, for example you know, having all inclusive, that means everybody should be taken care of, you know, ensuring equality in our society, ensuring that education and development programs are placed for the disadvantage. You know, I can name, list and listen this. This is what we mean when we say we are social democrats or alliance social democrats. That means alliance of the social democrat everybody coming together we work with everybody we have disabilities you know we have people who are disabled and we have not included them in our society so it's an all-inclusive package here which is to make sure that the rights of all you know is taken care of so this has absolutely nothing to do with being a socialist mm -hmm. yeah um remember i know for the mandika kamoto Okay, from Akamumpo Mole, Woleva Mola, Akilo Jahasoka, Atenata Muna, Mola, a social democrat, and Molonkata and Mola Poka. Then you know, they're not in the Molke Kilimoti, Moleke Kan Kilimoti. By the way, I did a Bangkok and Mongol Bijan Yogoni Moya de Pomokono, Munkeda, Yenumuni Alongo, this Abulo, the Munumum Fenway from all the Puyalongo, but it's all along in the Penon. Yellow will be in old, isolated, old phonology. 
ni muka le komi manke moti kon leo be jibe wona na da kala xamoti muna tina ay social democrat na ke pour mo la mu ya no ko ma fa an ma kala muka ani ki ma on understand muna tina woko kon yinna tina pour ka mo be tawo be ke kelo mo def gambe kelo mo be ya fa ne gambe ko no mo be right ko gambe ko ko Mm-hmm. So equality, I mean, for come from Nanka, La Fada and Dorong, I mean, for all the need to go, um, it all social democrats, it means socialism, monkey killing, the committee on doing goal, PDO, IS goal, it means killing, the committee on doing goal, PDO, IS goal, it means but you would agree with me, Marie, that um, there is an element of socialism in a social democrat in terms of providing social justice and providing, um, ensuring that there is equality within the society. Um, yeah, when, you ask, about, yeah mm-hmm. when you talk about socialists too, I don't want to sound like certain countries that have kicked that way into socialism, you understand? So we need to, um, we need to be very careful not to, um, how do you call it, align that, because that is not what we are all about. You know, that is one of the reasons I said, I don't want to go deep into that. What I need to focus on and what people need to focus on is that we are alliance of the social democrats. That means we are here to ensure that there's equality in our society. I think that explains all really, you know, mm-hmm. and you know, not to, not to, how do you call it, not to deviate from that because socialism is completely different. Mm-hmm. Okay, so um, does that mean, Marie, that because social democrats also involve a mixed economy? Because I read, I read international relations, so I, I kind of have an understanding of these things. So are you, uh-uh, let me frame this again. So it, it involves mixed economy. So it means that state intervention, you as a government, um, putting um, a lot of regulations for example, making sure that there is intensive tax on, on businesses is taking place in the country and controlling the economy. Um, it involves that as well, but in a democratic way. Does this mean that companies or corporations like um, TAF, for example, or AfriCell are going to suffer under your, or under your um, rule because you would ensure that you have um, increased the tax or you would be there to regulate, put more regulations, no, no. for example, to make sure these businesses don't take advantage of um, of the Gambian people. Is this well, what it means? No, that's not, it doesn't, the, the first part where you say making people suffer, we're not here to make any company or whatever suffer. Like I said, these companies are also, you have to also think that these companies are also here to create jobs. These companies are also here to help the economy. So you cannot make them suffer. What you need to do actually is to um, help them, to promote them, but then also give them um, a certain, um, how do you call it, leverage in order for them to be able to su- survive in the economy because they're also part of the economy. But um, like I said, I don't want to get much into that because you're tapping also into my uh, road plan, into my roadmap, you understand? Let's just leave it, like I said, you know, there's nothing new about the social democrats in short, which is, you know, every like economic capitalism, you know, we are here to, you know, ensure workers' rights, equality in society and stuff like that. We're not here to stop companies. I mean, right now, as I speak to you, the do group is shut down, you know, and that is painful, you know, that is something, if my government was around, I, I would not allow that because you're talking about how many lives uh, that affected, you understand? and how many um, um, they're paying their taxes, they're contributing to the economy. So one has to look at that. So we're not here to have more companies shut down. We're here to actually encourage for more to come so our youth can have a job, you understand? And not mm-hmm. only that, it contributes to our economy and moves the country forward. But mm-hmm. like I said, we cannot get into all that uh, in depth because it's part of what is in my policy or in my manifesto. Yes, that's right, Mary. And and um, what you've said is right, but it also, we cannot deviate from the fact that it also involves state intervention. A lot of regulations, because we've seen it in the Scandinavian countries, in Sweden, Denmark, Finland, that those countries are all social democrats and they have, um, they, 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 they um, implemented a, a high tax rate for businesses. So they would allow the, 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 the capitalist world to move but on, but with regulation. Yes, so you are saying that you would not regulate the businesses. 
like I said, I don't want to get into socialism. I want to focus on what I told you about. And like I said, on my policies or in my manifesto, it is well explained there. Until that time comes, I think people will understand it more. I've already given you my, my take on that. And I think that answers your question uh, prior to you know, what we are saying now. Okay, about a bike of money, still a bit of member, man, you know, a technical child of a new bit of man on for Iba for no la molly and the money can come up because social democrat ying and come in for come bank all men book of Sweden in Denmark. Now, you know, all the livelihood is very good and what economic policy you all the time. Angali come out a couple of mixed economy where you be capitalism, but a business all your time and yama, but if any regulation ban the la la or business all can but in a yellow comedy. Uh, what do that uh, Malatika um, dwell day back deeper because I call by a manifesto conal and I be do cake and I can. So I left the day to find a fellow and you get a man for right now in 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 um in response to my in in Carmena because now you're like a German job in honeybees come left I job in Yammy but it's a whole normal in the room I meant for what I'm not going to be a young in Yakama, <laughs> Gambia funding cage in Labour Dokola on the official as Seattle. Con Alapa and the Mola Coning, other than Adela Mansa Punalo. A son and Dura and Adela Muyako, it gambeno by Pangelo or company to it gambeno by Consolo, company Muyalon for more backward official, I think company to Omar Dole. Upon the IGB, Dulbruba, Soron can be a drag and Senegal, Muyalon co, or a kid and a neighbor country to Jan. Who are Lomonia Lonco, Amania, according Ataran Atalon, a Senandi Mola, Ning Ataran Atalon, about about Catala, a Cato than the Dam in Purkajo, Durbu, Hanibi, Aitara Gambia, but in the IGB, Mola tourism being a big defend Wolakan, Ning Atar or Company by Nadasor of Gambia, where Muran told them in Odum, Dola Tanya, Bacalanadi, and in the industry, Caro Bitanyadi, Ning Sizuno Munkana, Wolkata, Utimia Lonco, Abalfa Warta. Sonia and the Bullat in a Poco, Nick Adam, what the Sida Walla Alamansa Funda, Abasoni and Duro Natila, Son and Domi Alonco, will be able Gambian or Nafa, Walla de la Hamoti, a Camupo in social Alan Democrat, Puru Gambian old Bea Calamuda Yam, and if they fall to buy you for Yamu Bagay. A baraka back and member, but it had to be the money. Marie Malatika Nindula Yabi. So, Marie, this is a yes or no question. Um, are you ready to regulate the taxes and introduce price control in your government? Oh, it's my no. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe somebody showed you my manifesto. You're beginning to scare me. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see it. I didn't see it. I just know about what you are on about. <laughs> are you ready to do that? Yes, indeed. In, for us to be able to move as a country, these are things that we need to look at. There's no price control in the country. I mean, I live... Uh, I live it every day. I send, you know, to buy something today, and the next day the price is up. I mean, and then the third day maybe they bring it down again because somebody said something. So we need to have, um, you know, proper policies on price control and make sure that it sticks. You know, this is what um, stabilizes the country and taxes as well. You know, we cannot just tax people the way we feel like. We need to be able to, you know, look at the taxes, um, how do you call it, reform. And like I said, I don't know if you're looking at my policy. I'm trying so hard not to go in, in debt. Miss <laughs> Baggy, <laughs> <laughs> you have to wait till my manifesto comes out. Okay, all right, <laughs> I'll take that. <laughs> it is great stuff. It is great stuff. It's stuff that we researched, um, we debated on, we put it together. You know, we are still writing here. See? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See? It's all here. But they, we give them the opportunity to sit down and edit it and make sure everything is okay. And then we turn around and then print it. And then we hopefully share it to everybody. Mm -hmm. 
Thank you. Then Remember. You can call me for another interview, and then now we can hit to the nail. We can go into detail. Yes, no problem at all. Thank you. Remember, I'm not going to be able to get tax credit. I'm not going to be able to get tax credit. I'm not going to be able to get tax credit. I'm not going to be able to get tax credit. I'm not going to be able to get tax credit. I'm not going to be able to and in your price control, man, so kunda katara bambanding wasi fala buka to market or dam maburu puli wale wake. So ala jabiro nying nise o phone on yado ronga move on. Ayala tax control nying dan vye kono at ay mol ba nandin dol nying keran dol tabi kwa nying dol koma tu. Bayere nye tax ba la business manos dan. Ete ay mera wol ba nye deliver la ila banko o moka. Wen ara ke kudu miya lang po ay mol ba nandin. Say mol ka la kula pidi kiyo lpa dan artistop la pari anin business manos wol teng. Bayar ya tax mulai kan? Tax mulai awal kan? Ni hantar orang ke awal kali ada. Anu, ini ini ada ekspor ke awal bina awal price awal mungkin buat dalam tol ma. Apa kita lagi sini awal price ni? Of course ada awal table. Abi ada business awal jenis la. Kon, ada pelan kata ni la ko. Obi kita kudu mian long ko. Aba doku ala anda balam manifesto atau manifesto mian long ko. Naf ini dah dong gambia dong baji jala pakai la de. Kalau kata ni mungkin la ko. Ni ada orang ada long. Kalau apa tax control ni? Sambalan dan dua malam musa kata ni ko gambian no besi kamu nak pagi anim business mano. Bari apa akabal danila? Maybe apa kela interview mundi next sekarang ramai manifesto ni pareta. Mobi bokon danila gambian ko mobi bokon dana. Balon nak ko ha 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 ha. Umpam manifesto ramai kecahan kudi. Kecahan. Aku tembak tembak. <laughs> Yo, sila nga move on to the uh, ten cardinal pillars. Maya longko muna wala mbang akawal akakumandi wala ten cardinal pillars. Kodi ko points. Akakumandi nyadi la marike la pillars wala kumandi ko ten cardinal pillars na. Ha, lakta le yedo manding for mole. Ha, cardinal pillar nying. Ye mem for ko ibe mendo ko ka nga no ko ikwe man lafika dun into detail. Bari malo ko ibe so fe so man wala mole ni ka ko mole. Cardinal pillar nying, abe mo la livelihood falling no la nyadi le Gambia. How would the ten cardinal pillars change the livelihood of life, livelihood of Gambians? The ten cardinal pillars are our work plan, which is our manifest. This is our, I call it the ten cardinal pillars because I feel that these are the pillars that hold our society, that is holding our society. These are the pillars that we need to work on for the country to move forward. When you have 10 cardinal pillars, that means each pillar is your work plan, that you work on it and it builds, you understand? So we call it the 10 cardinal pillars because these are the structures, these are the um, handicaps. Just like I said earlier, these are the work plan that we need to fix Gambia. By the time we're done with it, Gambia should be okay, you know? It, it, and it goes from education to healthcare to um, uh, the uh, women and youth empowerment, to um, infrastructure, uh, agriculture, you know, security. It covers all of that. And we mm -hmm. focus on only that 10 because these are the major issues that are uh, um, damaging Gambia right now that are, you know, um, 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 bringing Gambia to its knees. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, remember? Okay. After you come on, you can make your job in the world and you take a lot. Manifesto ni munga tadi ko, ya ni ni kau muna mungkin kita ten cardinal pillars ni. Oleh kata tadi la ko, kata tadi la muna ko, walaupun each pillar ni, ada napa atau napa soto lembu ya tadi la ko, kami nusi muna pangala. Bayar ini nara nak keram bunda atau program orang, kita nak call tu, tu muni alam ko development of carol tu, na lebutanol tu, na 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 famu tu, famu ya alam ko, nienda binderol ni. Harvesting kela wall leto, kon wall dia kita turut sila mui alam kau dia memang manifesto kono. Yang kau kena wall, besi yang muna pang wall, mungkin kita ala ten cardinal pillars. Alas tak puru kau wall di Allah, puru alih lama itu, ba 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 kai, kata nalo kau, nina hamoti, puru kau nina di mui ada nak kau kena di muna pang alasan. So ayah aku fana kau ala ten cardinal pillars wall, ay security satu jele. And dung fananga kai agriculture suta jele. So I love to ka dung security nyung kono le domanding. Ka jibe atela understanding of national security mumineti at the moment. Ala no, understanding um, of... Like I said, these, you see all these questions you're asking me on the policies and these are things that I will answer once 
after after I've become the official uh, or officially announced as a presidential candidate. Like I said, I'm an aspiring presidential candidate, and I cannot go in depth into certain um, discussions because I'm right. going against the um, how do you call it IC. As an uh, aspiring um, a presidential candidate, I can just tell you about my intentions why I'm running for this um, high um, place in office. You know, and then once my manifesto is ready and I am also done with the IEC, I shall turn around and give you all these answers. Trust me, they're all there, but mm -hmm. you have to also allow me to be able to complete the things that I need to complete to get mm -hmm. to that point. Right. I wasn't I wasn't actually asking you to go into detail. I just wanted to get to your understanding, just to understand your own understanding of security. But when I do get to understand it, then I get into that because that is okay. understanding that I put on paper. All right. Okay. No, no, I won't go further with that so that's fine so it means the question around governance security and and um economy i'll have to hold on to those yeah okay so no problem well, at all we, we, we move on part of our cardinal pillars was security economy i mentioned all that it's all part of our you know so it is all there you, you understand but i can't just go in there okay okay no problem at all marie and uh, we move forward now to um Say now we've the you've 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 gone through the IEC and you're now a candidate and the elections is gone. You didn't win, you know. And because if we if if the 2021 or the new constitution is um, implemented, then it means that um, the first past the post would be discarded, and we're looking at the 50 percent now. So if you are approached by um, a political party to form an alliance with you. Um, can you tell us which political party that, that, that would be? I've said on all my platforms, I'm not here to join anyone. You know, right. we're not here to join anyone. We stand alone and whatever we have on our manifesto will still be worked on regardless mm -hmm. whether in office or not. Right. So you're not, you're not planning to form an alliance. That's right. So say ngani ning come now remember akita na koi pata tale but I promise this is the final part say so, new question number one that I will but I got to tell you. Ya no tell what dia bo mbuka pata to anyway but um ngani ning come now we len nyinti ko come say sila 2021 ning election oketa in ata foko um political party ya approach and after pura na e kafu Puru ye 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 join masa kuna nyimkono kumsa like the new constitution or nada abekela um fifty percent let's say so for more say fifty percent sort of puriye ke president only so for example ning doile forty three percent sort of after nung Maria lafai kam for Maria persona wala le banka alliance form puru kata into coalition or kata into government nga ni ning kawal. Ah, I'm not a coinly Gambia dealer, a la diam Buna also, and I think TV Buna and Musro Munkera television Buna, the Anisabio Buna Bay. A Tandila Co, a Temana Puruka joint Matista, a Wope Quetam Molda, and after the Puruka, only Molbina Puruka Mako and Mako. Bataman Tarakatari, Molena and Yana Mako, Kambe Tanako, Malong Mobe or Kalamuta, a brava Pokam. for example, you are going to a village, a village in Kenaba or a village in Quinella or, 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 or somewhere in Badibu and, and, and you were there, you need to speak to the people about your policies and your intentions. Do you think lack of speaking fluent Mandinka would weaken your campaign? No, I don't think so, because I've been to most of some of these um, villages and, you know, like I said, um, people accept you based on how you interact with them, you know, the communities accept you based on how you are with them, you know, how you humble yourself. Um, mm -hmm. I speak English because I, when you want to reunite a, a country with different tribes, you need to choose a language which we all went to school and learned. 
And in a case that some people don't understand the English language, that is one of the reasons anywhere I go, regardless, whether it's um, 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 Kulandu or whatever, I have you know people to translate because I don't want to have favorism here. You know, when I'm alone and I'm going to a village, it's different. Then I play along, like most of the things you were saying in Mandingo, I kind of understood that. And I even answered in English. So when I go there, I play along, but to speak, you have to be careful what to speak. And also when you're trying to reunite a country that is divided, then you need to choose one language. I mean, you can also ask me why I'm not using sign language. Sign language is like an international language for all because this also includes the disability so they can understand me when I'm talking. So yeah. but we use that one language that connects all of us so we can understand. And anywhere I go, I can have somebody like Memba or, you know, uh, 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 what's her name, Ms. Bahir to translate you know but i've been accepted in all these communities and i don't have any issues staying there some of them i stayed three nights you know and interacted nicely with them and i never had any issue with that and i think they 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 appreciate me for that mm -hmm. yeah remember atebe kela nyadi le fo tala campaign on yin weekend la bambari morsa mira le ko they cannot relate with her because amela kama moy by the um ngalone ko suru aka woni mani ka kama wole gena ka fo gambia um whether na accept or not nyin kam fulol wole gena ka fo jeto so english of course wala na official language the bari um ngani nin ka wala da so ala jabi no nyin fanyi please amara maridi ya muda mobe ya moy ko manda o ba tala problem bi fasti me ko kanno o man de gambia de gambia mo man kanno sa ko ko man ka suruwa mo jaan do la wala ka ko seere ma jela ko adala ko man ala mun na wala gambia de de ko mo an ka tan de mo de la ko aman ke ko abu ka san ko ni man ke sinya polo de wala pula atara san ko le ka ma de ka san do la ko banko to pour ani ka tara ngo kan ne ani ka ko de ngo kan ne do ma tinna pour wo sa tinna ko woy problème na la campagne ko ni adi be bi Mari bala be mun te dolaji kulo manjako mandinko surwa anu ni man surwa kawo moy ibo manika kawo moy ni man manika kawo moy ibo surwa kawo moy la anda man ke ko falang gambe be le manika kawo moy surwa kawo moy gol bi le surwa kawo moy le manika kawo moy akodo atema je ko wala woy ke problem bi nyaaje ay dol be na tan ke le pour gambe ke no kamma ni atara ko atara bi amala surwa kawo la bi ko manika kawo la dola bi jan sara hole bi jan sero ro bi jan so ndol mandara gambe je kanko ni manke mandin ko ti wali mo mani ka kama moy eta lola no ka gambia samba nyaato ani wala ka ti gambia mon sab ke ni wala man sawo man sama ta na la je ko gambe mon gambe la de gambe manke mandin ka tati gambe manke dola tati gambe manke kula wala serer tati ma je la ko gambe mon gambe la di be mo ba de ni amoy trai ko lon gambia ti adala ka ka wala fo mo le pour ya understand mo nyaama ka je ko gambe mon gambe kila mo among the commanding code the commanding code am flow di am jola am sa ma pel so pro mo bi akalam ko nyama ka ko am man ni ka kam moy de man suru akam moy and mo gambe nol di so o ba kala nya di le ka ko ni man ka moy ta kala no ni di ani gambia la kala no bon di system of kono ni system ko na mo bata ni la mo la ko de mo gambia nol di and mo be mo ba di kilo moy ka ko gambia kili akili kili na ni akili na ta nya ko gambe di bon Nabaraka, Abaraka, back your member. I'm near you know, question on Yeninka. Um, Nadia Modo asked a pigeon, no question or is very tribalist, but I'm playing the devil's advocate here. I have had conversation with people, and these are some of the things that people tell me. Ning Marima Manika Kamwe, and in Tolu will be Diamula Yadil, and it's a fact that cohabitas and totally, and in Molbe communication or killer water. So I Gabi Romanke, Namira Molbe alone. So it's not. Some personal to me because in fact I am not Mandinka anyway, so I'm Jola and I cannot speak Jola. I speak more Mandinka than Jola and I speak fluent Wolof. So um just for our humble viewers there to understand that this is not um a personal question, it's something that concerns people. And I think I am here to relay that those things to, to Mary. Um so moving on now, Mary Nadung Kachako no Kumanat add in culture in Drasila. Bedi Yalo no ko gambia wo mo ada ko ada bangolende say muso muso fresi kamo iko muso le fintisanang 
a Maria kuma kotla ko ayo be tint bitunga kati da kana ke president wati sila modol ko musola palaso muso konalt kadimba ya jibe katabiro ke ite muna soto kanko moli many alon ko yewo concept si fala soto muso yewo perception o ming soto about muso is a woman's place is at the home what do you have to say to people like that well i want to tell those people to start waking up because the world is moving. We're in the 21st century. The old is growing and the new is coming. You just, all you have to do is look at your kids. Look at your children nowadays. Your children are fast tracked. You know, they even come home and the old people are like, why are you looking like this? Or why are you dressed like this? Or why are you starting? You know, things are changing and we need to change at that time. And that is the only way we can get out of the stigma. You know, that is old fashioned and really, um, at this point and time in our lifetime, it's kind of derogatory, you know, to say that a woman's place is only in the kitchen, you know, and this is when you tell that to a woman after some time, she will bounce back because she has to prove to you that my place is not only in the kitchen, you know, women have are just as important and have roles to play in the development of our nation as anybody else as a man, you know, and we need to change that approach in order for us to be successful. Because you have a lot of powerful women out there. And like I said, in the home alone, what a woman can do from the morning till the night, most men wake up, they go to work, they come home, food is ready, their clothes are ironed for the next day, dinner is ready, they go to sleep. But it's the mother who makes sure that the, the food is on the table. It's the mother who makes sure the children are taken care of. It's the mother that makes sure the children study and go to bed. Then the whole routine starts again. And if she's working, she still goes to work. If she goes to the farm, she goes to the farm. You go to the rural areas. The women are in the farms. From the farm, from the heat, they come home and they cook. And they make sure everybody's okay. So you cannot now put a woman in a box like in the old days. Times are changing. Maybe in the old days, those opportunities were not there. But right now, with all these opportunities out there, trust me, women can do a lot more because there's one thing a woman can do that men up to today cannot do, which is have a child. Sonia, mm -hmm. remember. Okay. Remember, I work on the very new Musobi, it's a whole lot of Musoka meaning in months and you know, a lot of Musoka time in a president. I just spoke on it. Very at a Kawala Javi Kata to Molako, Dunia said, Moment of Tamora Munsa and Molako. Moba Murum Co Moldo. Mobi came near a lady and yam in Yako. Con Molia Bulaka Hoko, Musota Kalanoni, Musota Kalanoni, Yamuso Jim Mokono, Musoleva Kobe Kella, Musoleva Taburo Kella, Musoleva Danino de la Dino Lamunta Karamor. It came up with our do called Edina Musoleva Taburo Kere, Obe Kamala, Nata Rulo Kalam Kono, Tata Danino, and Nata, at Ajelako, a barata Lokando Bilkono, a bitala Minakala that I sing in Dajongi. Abara Dimba Balu Lagami. Con Okumo Monkey Kuma to Mialongo as a high atal, by the Mobe Alan Nepo. Musosa Munkano, Alakumo, the Wallen in the Pro, Kewoldo to be a Mulumbo Kelano, Wallen in the Pro, Nina the Wulu Carol, Kewata Wulu Nola. For Modimina Ronda 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 Ronda, Musosa Kemonia from Forty, who have all the Tanik and Kamuso Semundia, Bundi Molda from the Munka for Musota Pansaya Nola, Waleta Sukon, Musota Silano Sukon, Musoe. Family Sorola, Badimo Sorole, Committee Badimo Soronyami, Nikata Doko Leka Gina, Nikat Danino Sambe Ila 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 Ulula, Umusu Kiluma Palo, Ame Kiluma Labala, Pura Paleta Danino, Ayabama, Pama Balloon, for Nitoko Way Siswok on Abulo and Danoka, Mala, a ketchup put in Mialongo, Pusa Hayariola, Wolaketa, Kumo de Mumbora, our excellent team of Dakono, Proka, La Munuba. <laughs> Abaraka, Abaraka, Bake, um, still I'm going to move on down to Marifa as a female leader. Kajibe, um, at some of the barriers I may face and a la carrier corner from being a more entrepreneur, a la new business or a men attending, I move barrier or challenges I will face because of Musola Mat. Maria, what will happen? Yeah, it's normal. You know, in a, in, if you are an entrepreneur and you work in the field, in men's field, it is normal. You know, men will try, you know, they want to see how resilient you can be. They want to see whether you can take the heat like them. And eventually they tend to accept you, you know, they tend to accept you. So I don't, I don't see all of that as a, uh, as a barrier. 
I don't see it as a challenge, uh, as, a, as a barrier, sorry. What I see is a challenge to myself. And I love the challenge because then I keep telling myself I can do it or I can break that. You understand? And so I don't see anything as a barrier that is hurting me or hurting um, where I want to go in my career at all. I take it as a honeycomb, it's something that is a challenging something that I have to break through, you know, through that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, remember? Yeah. So to my Niketa Mojumia Lonko, Iketa Doko Lati, Ketaro G Guru Momunsa Tinako, Mobia Lonko, Iketaro G Tawala Yumusugati. Niketa Motimia Lonko Mumuso Diva Keta Hokono. So what they want to fill a car long exactly the Mumosi Fanya. But I'm home and the food we had in a bar the Marisopla Yaruta Lonji Lady. A home was an open to your musa de po at the Wobatila at the Marisop to Dayato. Mm -hmm. Um, belief less of co perception also to come so many and a canyat of Kayaki. Maribe wo kuening Maribe would how would you deal with that? The, the male resistant resi, re, resilient or resistance. Come Kako, it will musoti sign to teacher support. La it will go kuening a batam and Well, first and foremost, I want all men before they come out there to um, say anything, I want all men to know that they come from a woman. Mm -hmm. And then I want all men to go back home and see what a woman can do in their homes. Where even when we have issues, we go back. Mary? I'm going to marry free Stella for some reason. Um, might be the network. Hello, Marie. Let me just check on Facebook with it. Is Marie frozen, um, viewers? Can you see? Oh, yeah. Sorry about that, Marie. You were frozen yeah. for a moment. Yeah. yeah. No, when I'm, when I'm accepting so far, mm -hmm. such wood, you know, I have been around and. I network and we've got I think two more questions to go um, but network will be more jump back and meanwhile I told them the more baker not a question so do I'll say something and nobody in binara popularly Maria are you bad yes I'm here can yes. you see me yes I can go on carry on oh dear Chat, chat, chat. Saya yang lempelentin bekerja walau kau kacakan dalam network atau balanda. Nak tengok kali any question soto. Meanwhile, Allah dunjinya. Saya pun semari jenin kaji nak baca beri question full ada marit tanya je jangan bela kopla. Be Facebook ni monitor kaji ne. Whilst we wait for Marie to come back. Nak tengok kali any question soto. Please, I'll say do no nane. Alias a fejan for comment box on you, Kono, beside you, Kunse Marinin in Kaja Navita. Yamida Freestyle. Hopefully, she would come back. And hopefully, I'm still live. Yeah, I think Marie is gone. Um, so let me know. So let me just read the comments. I don't think it's a female problem. Um, this is from Empress. We have female leaders in various positions in the Gambia. This ain't about that. Mary needs a campaign manager who will get her to dress nice and have enough light for interviews. Ah, <laughs> why Empress? Yeah, why Empress? <laughs> we can see Baji better than the presidential aspirant. Maybe Baji should run for office. Okay. <laughs> Empress, can I conversation do some manning junk, please? Um, but thank you for that. Um, Somebody called Ibrahim Kamara said, Mary, 
Hello? Are you back, Mary? Hello? Mary? Yeah, I think the network in the Gambia is playing up right now. Um, I'll just give Mary a chance to sort that out whilst I go through the comments here. So, um, Ibrahim Kamarato, Ako, Ako Marisok is fake. I don't care what language or how she dressed, but she is not the one we need right now. <laughs> okay, so from to, um, as to John Palmer, as to said, we are both industrialized and domesticated women. I love being in the kitchen personally. Thank you. Um, does she have an MBA? Why did she write on her Facebook page that she has an MBA when she didn't have that? So I think we've covered that in, in the interview, Jack Job. We've covered that she doesn't have a degree, she said. So that has been covered. Um, just going through the question. If you have any question or comment, just send it in and I will try and read it whilst we wait for Mary to reconnect. Um, so the question is, is uh, understanding of national security. Mary did not answer the question again. Um, this is from Jake Joe. Um, yeah, well, let's have a look. I think we've lost Mary again. Mary is the only solution to end tribalism in government. Um, this is from David Parker. Um, and then, okay. Yes, I think those are the only questions I, Patu, you did a great job. Thank you, Jake Job. Thank you. Um, yes, I think we would, it's a shame that um, we cannot reconnect with with Marie for some reason. I will try to call her back and we see whether she has any final, final words so we can wrap up this interview. I don't know what seems to be going on. So I'll mute myself for a moment and give Marie a call and see. Not picking, so I don't know what's happening. Sarata, if you're watching Sarata, if you can put the link, link of the of the Zoom link on on here, so that if other people want to join in, we can spend another five minutes just to get people's reaction to to this interview. Um, Sarata Jabi, Sarata, if you're watching, please um, could you. I think I can do it myself. Just copy the link here. Hmm. If you've got my WhatsApp number as well and you want to call, please do. It's 078-77251789. Um, to contribute. I'll be here until half past six. Um, hopefully, Mary would be able to join us before we end the program. Um, uh, bear with me, I just want to write a number down here. Plus four four Sarah. I don't know whether you're watching. Seven eight seven seven two five one seven eight nine. Yeah, so I've just blocked the thank you, Sarah. If anybody wants to join via Zoom or just want to call me on WhatsApp just to get a quick reaction to this interview today. Um hopefully we would get Mary back as soon as possible, at least for five minutes, so that um we can wrap this up. Um, 
Yeah, okay, we're getting Mary back. So I would ask you to hold on on the Zoom yet because I don't have, I don't want to have any other person on the Zoom um, apart from Mary, if she's back. Okay, here we are. Mary? Yeah, we had um, internet <laughs> interruption. I know, I understand. It's a Gambian connection, isn't it? It's really bad. We have to switch everything off and bring it back on come back on again. Hopefully when you become president, you could sort those things out for us. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do you want to carry on? Um, I think I was talking about male res resistance, um, how you would deal with male resistance in your campaign. Yeah, I was just saying that every man has a, has a mother and we all come from women. And also men want to see me and because men have daughters, most men have daughters, and you want to say to yourself, your daughter can be that woman uh, one day, you understand, because when you have daughters, you want to think great of them tomorrow, mm -hmm. and the message, I'm not going to answer that in the sense that I want to instead send a message to the men to start looking at women differently, especially since they came from a woman and also have daughters that they're raising. Because if it were your daughter standing out there today running for presidency, you would want everybody to support her. Mm -hmm. So since my father is uh, resting in peace, I hope all men uh, older that are more conservative to look at me as their daughter. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. Remember, I told almost the final one day. So I need to translate more yeah? Then we can move forward. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mm -hmm. And finally, last but not the least, um, Mari, do you genuinely think that you would win um, the elections or are you just here to reach out to the glass ceiling and then open the door for other women to contest? Well, I know, I know I will have a vast majority of the nation's support um, because I am not, um, I will, you know, like I said, I will have a vast majority of the nation's support and I am not one to make these predictions, you know, I'm not a soothsayer, you know, and from my beliefs, I just feel that, you know, things will manifest itself. This is the first time a woman is standing for presidency and standing alone in the sense that as an independent candidate and asking for people to come together as one. Um, other women stood before, but I don't think they had the same message that I have. And that message is strong in the sense I'm calling for unity, you know, and I'm here also to pave the way. I'm paving the way for all the young women out there to feel that, you know, they can have a voice. They can all step up and stand up and um, have a place in politics, you know, that I'm paving a way for another woman to stand. Then that woman should have been up with me by now and try to, because you feel that, you know, you cannot take the beating right now. What about the beating that you get once you're in the house? So 
Do you understand? So the journey is not over yet. The journey is just beginning. But like I said, this is a way as well for all young women out there to have, I think not, maybe it sounds uh, not right, but to have the, um, the zeal to see themselves in me or see me in them. Thank you. Your member, Nanya Ninkam and Nawal and Yentify, Atea, Miralako, Genuine Nikabe, Winla, Le Bankoa, Bunda, Le Yele Musoli, Doli, Doron, Puru, Wolfanansi, Naka, Plotty Cocon. Ah, Mamera, I Jaguro Mundi, Wola Yentiko, Molva Sopojala, Mumba Moi, Nafa, Mumba Sopojala, Mumba, and Yela Molako, Tonato, Nato, Nato, Atelon Moti, Munjaka, Puruna, Noma. Baby, you must all GD. If a sacrifice of Munta, Bumokon, and a Pukumoko. Munatina was sacrificed killing with a Tala no Purukata Mindi, come Latte, come Oleka, Lapata, come Puruka, Tamindiroke, Munketa, Napanko, Pana Carola, Munketa, na twenty twenty one election party, Bamun Expecta. On a code, Kusa Keno, Walla Mobia Escoco, Abba Mol surprised the party, Jagalo Muyat in a po. Maybe in the Ojala, but in Alasonda, Molbo Jahalo Jala, and I'm a Gambia base of Christ at Inshallah in Munkata, 2021 election voting. Alma Alain Lenia Sia, Alumola, I'm based with Gata Kendiala. See my Annie Hagetino, Kamol C, Walla Kamol Amendi, Ka 2021 election of Kalamutan in Gambia, Banco. On that note, Marie, I want to say a big thank you. We've come to the end of this program for this interview. And it has been a great honor to um, spend some time with you online. Um, personally, I really applaud you for your bravery, for your courage, and for reaching out to that glass ceiling and to show the whole world that women too can aim high and we can lead. Um, I think it's very encouraging. It's a, it's a, it's a new era for women women I always believe that we've always campaigned for women to come out and do this and I am over the moon right now to see a woman um, be out there and put themselves out there against all odds and all criticisms you're here you're still with us you're smiling and um, I just hope that other women too can emulate and, and come out because for me it's not just enough to see one person one woman I want to see a level playing field so thank you very much for your courage for your um, resilience and for your patience as well. And I wish you um, very best of luck for 2021. Um, and I hope that um, I would have another opportunity to talk to you when the manifesto is out. Um, I would really love to have another sit down with you, you know, on, on online and have a chat. So mbadi molu mbafu ka Maria Nedoronkaya, baraka bake, siyo meta baba bake le, barika faya pa baraka nata na menjang info digest, um, the digest news store, puru nae kacha katu ngajelo ko musol jama jama kom ngafo nyame itul katala bulu koso nin katala kuma bada tea itan dilo ko musol fanangse lo no le ka 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 hame ke hame me ya long kom be lafi lafuta la lafi taka futa glass ceiling o nyine to katala banko nyato nko fanang nga president ya nyin nga soto at least hana beke da si nya kilimoti for a start so nga ten tu wala ala resilient nyin nga nala courage nyin nga nala confident nyin nga nyin patient i mean beta ngal ne kunga question dol nyin ka janne kwaliyata bakele bari hani bi abe smal kan na be fenting abe sirim fe janne nga tol fanang tentu baki kal jaya tol men be jibe kan jang de digest news to um na tol mantana no jante sino la jang ka jibe ka fali pala baraka baki alla jibe ko nyimato ana la la moy nyimato ngam be ba fanang tentu nga jayi ate fanang ne patient nyin to ay sio menki jang even do ay ay koni magido manding lafa marila dia molto le do bije mari mari ka kuma dol fa camera ka la fa i think we've lost mari again at the last minute but um, thank you very much, Marie, um, for, for this opportunity. I don't know whether Marie left a like a last word so for very um Natara Kumobi Jelemel left a cafe for Namra saying, time when you exhaust Lenko Meta Rajan for half past six, but it's like Namra five minutes. The Mali to the Jenning Marie Nata no cotton during Ayala last word so for no, um, Wobe and Kontan Labaka is I just singing rap of no. Um, I'm just going to read the, the comments here from um, 
um, Empress Natalie, the Empress Go, and she shouldn't dress exactly like the translator. Um, <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, next time we want to be able to see her. Okay, thank you. Um, Empress Ngawo Moile, Fatu Elam Jame, okay, Gumangali Van Bake. So, Nga Mirako, that's it from us. Um, I would really love Marie to say her final, final um, words, because Nga Mirako Nyanta concluded remarks at a lot of Anongbule. It would be fair that way to have Marie to say her final words. Um, Mari Malong Gambia Network or Dal Moilo Mugini, Abe 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 Nyanga Kanadal. But to Naji be file of the any last last words for Lisa Jiko and singing program or Kumfan or Casio Metal. I think what I will do is just to wrap up here. I think um, she's already said a lot. Mm -hmm. Okay, so well, thank you very much, everybody. I think we would call it a day. Um, until next time, I am Fatu Baji. Um, have a good evening.